Are you facing the could not activate cellular data network error on your iPhone? This can be frustrating as it prevents you from accessing mobile data. It may arise due to network settings, SIM card issues, or problems with your carrier. Don't worry, this guide will provide you with effective solutions to help you resolve this error and restore cellular connectivity. Let's get started. Solution 1. Turn on and off airplane mode. Open settings on your iPhone. Look for airplane mode at the top, turn on and turn it back off, and see if this helps you to get your cellular bar or not. Solution 2. Eject and reinsert SIM card. Sometimes a simple SIM card reset can help. Use a SIM ejector tool or a paper clip to remove the SIM card tray. Take out the SIM card and wait for a few seconds. Reinsert the SIM card and ensure the tray is securely closed. Now restart your iPhone. Solution 3. Check cellular settings. Ensure that cellular settings are correctly configured. Open settings on your iPhone. Tap on cellular. Make sure cellular data is toggled on. Scroll down to check if cellular data options are configured correctly. Keep in mind that being able to use data you need a plan or need balance in your SIM card. With these, you will not be able to fix these issues. Solution 4. Turn network selection off and on. Resetting the network selection can refresh your connection. Open settings on your iPhone. Tap on cellular. Scroll down. Tap on network selection and toggle it off. Wait a moment, then toggle it back on. Now restart your iPhone. Solution 5. Reset Network Settings This can fix misconfiguration affecting cellular connectivity. Open Settings on your iPhone. Scroll down. Tap on General. Scroll down. Tap on Transfer or Reset iPhone. Then select Reset. Choose Reset Network Settings and confirm your choice. Note, this will erase all saved Wi-Fi passwords. By following these steps, you should be able to fix the could not activate cellular data network error on your iPhone and regain access to cellular data. If this guide helped you, don't forget to subscribe for more troubleshooting tips and stay tuned for the next video.